Hello and welcome to another modeling video. This is Alan from the Mokona Man at YouTube with a, another modeling tutorial. This is just an extremely quick tip on um, paints. Now you'll notice in your uh, spray cans, when you rattle it, there's um, a rattle sound. Why they're rattle cans? It's because there's a ball bearing and it cuts through the uh, mix of uh, thinner pigment, binder, all that, and it just helps bring everything together than just um, sloshing everything that's inside and relying on it to mix itself. So the ball's bouncing around and mixing your paints. A long time ago, in the um, 90s to early 2000s, Alclad also had a small ball bearing in their paint and when that lacquer's um, sit around for ages you have all the pigments at the bottom and all the different layers of chemical is layered and when that ball goes around it mixes everything up paints do not have this so during my last trip to Japan Mr Hobby has released uh, this G tool which is a pack of 50 ball bearings for 400 yen. A little expensive, yes, but I just wanted to buy the packet to show off in a review. It is as uh, simple as uh, popping her open, grabbing a ball bearing, and putting it into your paint. These are also pretty uh, beefy ball bearings. And if we're going to have trouble, or if you ever have trouble mixing any type of uh, paint, it is always a primer. They're recyclable, so once your uh, paint has run out, you can just mix it in with uh, the same colour, dr directly dropping it in, or cleaning it up and putting it into a new bottle. Now, mixing it up. At first, the ball bearing had a little trouble travelling around because everything is at the bottom and you can actually hear the rattling sound and it's mixing up the primer. For primers I might put two three in but for all of my paints I'll be putting in one ball bearing. So that's a bit of a trip um, it could avoid uh, stirring and that just makes your hobby a little easier. You do not have to buy these uh, hobby brands of uh, ball bearings or uh, Mr. Hobby, you can go on eBay and for a couple of dollars you can buy a few hundred uh, ball bearings. The larger the ball bearing, the better. So 4 mil, uh, 5 mil or bigger. Uh, thank you very much for watching and as always, until next time, catch you guys later.